Hi guys, I'm back with another video. So this time another movie trailer. Khel Khel Me. So I'm gonna review the trailer Khel Khel Me. So Khel Khel Me trailer stars Akshay Kumar, Tapsi Pannu, Pannu, Vani Kapoor. So in in which in in a hilarious game of secrets and lies, the trailer introduces us to group to a group of seven close uh, knit friends with Gasta with Gasta for a dinner party. So gather the so they gather for a dinner party with a twist as they surrender their switch phones and embark on a game secrets and lies begin to unravel exposing hidden truths about each other the classic song Parda Me Utaro plays in the background setting the tone for the unfolding drama so the much awaited trailer of Kale Kale Me is finally out offering a glimpse into the hilarious and the incurring plot of the film, starring a talented assembled cast including Akshay Kumar, Tapsi Pannu, Immi Virik, Vani Kapoor, Fadeen Khan, with a comeback, Ditya Seel, and Pragya Jaswal. The movie in, is directed by Mudsar Aziz who has previously helmed the comedy film Happy Bhag Jaigi. The film is set to release in cinemas on August 15, 2024. The trailer introduced us to a group of seven close-knit friends who gather for a dinner party with a twist as they, uh, as they surrender their pawns and embark on a game. Secrets and lies begin to unrive and unravel exposing hidden truths about each other. The classic song Pardame Rene Do plays in the background, setting the tone in the falling drama. The interviewing promise sets the stage for a in thrilling zing comedy and lies. The game tries, uh, they, the game they embark on, which involves unlocking their phones and sh sharing their personal messages and calls, creating an atmosphere of embarrassment and discomfort, focuses them to comfort to reality of their relationship. The film will face a, a box office clash with two other highly anticipated Bollywood releases, Street 2, starring Raj Kumar Rao, Shraddha Kapoor, and Pankaj Tapati, and Veda featuring John Abraham and Sharvari. It will be interesting to see which film emerges is victorious in this clash. So, yeah, the trailer uh, uh, is okay, to be honest. It's about this game, and the uh, seven hit friends, and, and they play this game. And the uh, tell about secrets and lies and there's a twist in the party and uh, and there's a secrets and lies that begin the verbal exposing hidden truth and the song plays Pardeme Rene Do Pardeme Uthara Pardeme Rene Do Pardeme Uthara the song plays in the background and in, in the intro at the background setting on the tone for a falling drama the, the trailer is okay, like I said. I like the poster when the poster came out for the film, all the characters on the poster and doing that, sh that, yeah, on the poster. But the trailer is okay, not bad. And uh, Immiviric as well, second film after Bad News. And uh, Akshay Kumar with his uh, gray uh, hair he has in this. So they made him a little bit older. For Dean Khan is looking promising because he disappeared. Then he lose weight. Then he came back. And this is his comeback. So I don't know the film will be a successful or not. Time will tell. It has some twists and comedy, and uh, yeah, and they're talking about Tiger Shroff and all that, and all that. 
Yeah, it's just like a game they're playing. Yeah, and this this party and this embarrassing. And Topsy Pony has the same look as Kangaroo and our the hair. And uh, yeah, the trailer is uh, okay, like I said. But the comedy they did, they did what they did. But uh, like I said, uh, my first choice was Street Two. And Veda was Veda trailer. Veda and Street Two are looking promising. So yeah, the trailer is average. It's average. I don't think this film will click at the box office. If the film clicks, the story, only the story. If the story is strong, it will make sense. So Kale Kale me, I'm gonna give two out of five. I didn't like the trailer to be honest. It's average. Yeah, but a good to see is for Dean Khan on the screen once again. Yeah, he has a uh, uh, lost weight and he's looking amazing. Yeah, because he uh, he went to into depression and he left Bollywood. He's a two thousand actor, nineteen ninety nine and two thousand actor. Yeah, because his films were not working at the box office. The guy went on depression, which is sad. So this is could be his comeback. Time will tell. Well, my both uh, other films I'm interested is a uh, Veda because it's fantastic action packed film. John Abraham Sharvari and the Street to the horror comedy film. Like the first one clicked at the box office in 2018. So this is I'm gonna give two out of five. Yeah. Just uh, on logic for me, the trailer. This is play this game, just like a game show you're watching. It's that kind of feeling. It doesn't look like a film. This is playing a game and all that. This secrets, this twists. A Maverick's looking promising in the trailer. He said banjo or whatever he said in the trailer. <laughs> yeah, he swore banjo. Yeah, he said that. Yeah, and uh, yeah. Like I said, for Dean Khan's looking promising as well, but I don't know this comeback will be successful for him. And uh, yeah, I like the song Holy Holy Nuts because that song was decent by Guru Dondhava, Nea Kakkar and uh, Yo Yo Honey Sing song, which I already given the review. I like the song of that and they released the other song as well. And the trailer come out and the uh, trailer is average. Yeah, trailer is average. Can't guarantee if the film will click. Only the audience will decide if the the film clicks with them. Only true con content will win at the box office. I think Street Two will win and Veda will win on Independence Day. This is looks like uh, not uh, gonna click at the box office in my opinion. I don't think this film will do any wonders. Another uh, flop is guaranteed once again for Akshay Kumar because. Akshay Kumar give the disaster like Baremia shot me in April of this year, then Serfia in July this year, and now is another film is coming out again. Kail Kail Me. Yeah, it's not gonna happen with him. With Kail Kail Me, I don't think this film will click. It depends on the content, the characters, the punchline, the dialogues, the twists, twist and turn, and this un unveil a game and all that. Yeah, and this group of friends doing this. Yeah, this uh, setting and all that. So yeah, it's average trailer. I didn't like the trailer, guys, so my answer is no. Yeah, like I said, if I like a trailer, give it 4 out of 5 or 5 out of 5. If the trailer is brilliant. Yeah, the trailer is okay, average. So I'll give it 2 out of 5. Yeah, the, uh, the characters and all that. Let's see, I want Akshay Kumar to succeed, but at the moment it's not going to be this film as well. This is going to be another disappointment of Akshay Kumar Kriya once again. Yeah, those two films disappointed. But Sarfeda people give support of Akshay Kumar's performance, but the film didn't be supported. The film was a remake, like I said, and the people already seen the original. Sumuru Putru and uh, Uran of a Hindi dubbed film. So yeah, so I don't think this film will click. It depends on the story and the audience. And uh, yeah, I don't know. So I want Akshay Kumar to come back and give a solid film. Akshay Kumar deserves better than this film. It's like a cringe film, this is. 
just uh, unlogical for me to be honest yeah like i said akshay kumar is not working at all in today's times and uh, audience do not want to see him that much in a year one or two is fine but he makes four films in a year because he's working hard he's he's not bothered with the failure what happens if happens he focus he moves on and gives his best but yeah yeah like as a kel kel me trailers not up to the mark for me so uh, i'm gonna give a two out of five i hope uh for dean khan clicks with the character in this film because uh it's been a while i've not seen for dean khan after a long time then he put on weight then now he'll come back into his weight and come back into acting so yeah it'd be sad if the film doesn't click with him because for dean khan didn't do well in his career to be honest only hey baby and uh, no entry was the best films in his career and yeah after he out of jana sheen and ek sina khilari that film failed as well jana sheen failing as well he had dave that film failed khushi it was okay film decent yeah he did other for kuch main kahun kuch tum ko ho that film failed as well so he did some films mostly the films are failed so i can't guarantee this film will click it depends if the content is sensible gauging clicking for audience only the true content wins at the box office so my main focus is on veda i love the trailer and street to only that's it so i can't guarantee this film will click i did not like the trailer is a ups and downs i will give it two out of five so this is my honest reaction for kale kale me trailer two out of five so yeah i don't know i want to actually come out to succeed guys but it doesn't look like this film is going to be succeeding it's going to be another disappointment of this year of akshay kumar which is sad akshay kumar deserves better films he deserves comedy he should do hera fairy welcome free and all that then he can make a comeback because welcome is not going to happening it was going to come out this year december time they postponed it i don't know what happened they moved it for the god knows what happened to the film time will tell so yeah khel khel mein is average sorry guys is average now 2.5 stars for khel khel me trailer only the holy holy nuts song is good i like the song that's the positive of the part of the movie yeah time will tell with the film clicks i hope of every film clicks but it doesn't work like that recent film came out last friday ajay devgan's tabus and jimmy shekel film oroma kya damta and is only managed to collect 275 crores samilara and the film is already a disaster yeah and ulaj with uh, janvi kupo does and looks like a disappointment film as well it's not been a good friday last friday it has been two films disastering ajay devgan a list actor maharaj actor failed again in orome kya damta is had no strength in the film to succeed yeah that film has failed as well at the box office only kalki 2 made a good business and kalki 2 was the winner film of this year for me absolutely fantastic by bachan saab as a abhimanyu and yeah how he uh, took a pabas down because the film they did it for the film so i like kalki 2898 much better ad film so kel kel me trailer 2.5 is average no it's too average for me i didn't like it so so logical it just doesn't it didn't click with me so two out of five for um khel khel me trailer so i want akshay kumar to deserve a film better and do good films then you cree will come back you do good films if you keep doing cringe films your films not going to work so yeah that's my opinion on it so two out of five for khel khel me trailer didn't like it is average ami virak was decent as well yeah i want ami virak to click in bollywood and uh, he's trying his best like i said he's working in punjabi cinema he's singing he's better in punjabi his bollywood is not click for him to be honest so he's looking good with topsy pannu and uh, ditya seal is another disappointment actor as well we have to see how the film offers to the audience at the box office so my uh, verdict is 2.5 khel khel mein so i will see you in the next one hope you like subscribe and share and comment stay safe play safe bye